I'm going to give you an example that doesn't have anything to do with our desktop laptops or, well, has to do with servers to some extent. But, you know, Schneider Trucking is a company in the Midwest in the United States, and they run 18 wheelers that carry goods all across the United States. Each engine of the truck that they run costs about a million and a half dollars. Each breakdown can run into the hundreds of thousands of dollars. They have about 650 breakdowns every year. That's because the driver gets, you know, a code, a flashing light on the dashboard and he or she has to struggle with, okay, what does this mean? And they pull aside and they pull out a huge manual to try to figure out what's going on. And that even delays their, their delivery times, which are very stringent. Um, and they have a, a lot of dollars tied to the time of delivery. So what they did was they, using telematics, they started to beam up these codes uh, through the cloud into their uh, home servers and using machine learning they were able to decipher from these massive manuals what exactly is the error and then send a simple English text message to the driver to say this is what you should do uh, and that saved them millions of dollars they, they went from 650 breakdowns a year to zero uh, using you know a combination of RPA and, and machine learning technology. So that's a very interesting use case that I've seen out there. Did that also include a bit of predictive analytics to say like when the truck Absolutely. Is for maintenance? Absolutely. You know, judging from past maintenance records of what has happened and how this error translates into what they have seen in the past, they were able to use that to drive the predictive capabilities as well. I mean, just that pattern of something coming up, a person having to figure out what to do and kind of using AI to shortcut the choice there. I mean, that's a great right. example. We can put that anywhere. You can put that in a call center. The, the, they could be listening in on the call, help diagnose mm -hmm. what the problem is, come back with the answer even before the person has finished answering the question. I mean, that's what we're looking at right now, a super high proactive um, application of AI integration, integrated into the operations, not just for thinking and decisions, but to affect the day-to-day -day operations. It's, that's a great example. Thanks for, thanks for sharing that, Chad.